all right in this video i'll be showing you how to create a new wechat account okay maybe you are new into your new into mini importation you rightly need wechat account as it stands i already have an existing wechat account so in order to show you step by step how to create a new wechat account i'll need to log out my account okay so I'm going to log out click on me okay let me quickly log out to show you step by step on how to create a new wechat account now before we dive into the video proper in case you're just coming across my channel for the first time i'm Lawrence fine by name i do entrepreneurship videos on how to make money online as it regards to e-commerce affiliate marketing freelancing with digital skills so if you're interested in getting this kind of content please consider subscribing this channel by clicking on the red subscribe button down below this video turn on the notification bell so you always get notified each time i drop a new video like i rightly said i'm going to be showing you how to create a new wechat account okay now first off before you begin creating a new wechat account you need to if you don't have wechat account you need to go into google play store and type in wechat okay you type wechat you can see it okay you can see i already have it installed okay like i rightly showed you so you just click if you don't have it you just rightly click on um download so that you download it or you install it okay but in my case i already have it so i'm going to click on open okay so this is the wechat account now if you install the new wechat uh, a, a new wechat application here your interface will be different from my own interface it's going to show black and then um at the left side here you're going to have the login option then at the right side here you're going to have the sign up um option okay but in my case because i signed out of my existing wechat account okay so in this case i am going to use a different option so in order to get the sign up option i'm going to click here where you have more options so you can see the sign up option here you can see so i'm going to click on sign up to begin the process so i click on sign up now on this new page that opens you are required to enter the username be it uh, a full name or just a short name as a username okay then the second one you choose the country you choose your country in my case is nigeria so i'm going to be choosing nigeria then here you're going to input your phone number the phone number you'll be using to um sign up this new wechat account then the next is your password after password you need to click on this circle uh, button this radio button okay click on it to agree to terms of service as soon as you've done that this sign up button will turn to green and you click on sign up now let's go so first off i'm going to put in the username i'll be using for this okay I can use this okay then secondly i'm going to enter my country so i'm supposed to scroll down and choose nigeria but for quick um selection i'm going to choose use the search option here okay i use the search option and then inside this search uh, bar i'm going to type in nigeria you can see nigeria so i'm going to choose nigeria okay i'll click on nigeria to select nigeria i've selected nigeria the next thing is the phone number so i'm going to enter the phone number now i want to emphasize a little bit on the phone number if you're entering the phone number um the nigeria you choose has taken care of the first zero okay you have plus two three four it has taken care of the first zero so if you're entering your phone number skip the first zero that begins with zero seven zero or zero eight zero so you're going to start from seven zero down or eight zero down you don't need to include the first zero that begins with it okay so i'll pause this video and enter the phone number and the password at the same time then we'll continue so now i'm done entering the password the next thing is to click on the uh, agree to terms service so i click there the next thing is to click on sign up okay now we'll begin the process now before it loads completely i'm going to uh, quickly tell you why you need which are if you are an importer you are buying products or you have been making use of uh, 
1688 or you just started wechat is very very important for um, suppliers communication you need wechat to also uh, communicate to your chinese suppliers effectively okay why is wechat is important wechat is important because um it tries to um bridge the gap between the language barrier we have between um the english speaking countries and chinese okay wechat has an inbuilt translator okay which um if you're chatting with a supplier and your supplier chats you in chinese you can also chat in english and you can be able to use the inbuilt translator okay function that is the inbuilt uh, uh, translator function that is in the wechat app to translate the chinese uh, chats sent to you by your supplier and with that you can uh, be able to understand what your supplier is saying in the other way around on the other side your supplier can also translate your english language into chinese and he or she can be able to understand what you are saying okay now we we'll proceed now on this privacy policy what you need to do you are allowed to read this but you don't need to in because of time just what you after reading it you just need to uh, click on this small button to say i have read and agreed to the above terms okay so that's what we're going to do you click on it as it turns blue you click on next so it's going to take you now to the um security verification page It's loading we're just going to give it a uh, time to load now it's going to after processing is going to land you to this page the next thing you need to do you click on start okay next thing you need to do is to click on uh, the start button as you can see here okay you need to click on start click on start it takes you to the puzzle page where you need to um verify that you are human okay so in this uh page what you need to do there's a green uh, blue button that will come up this okay you just need to click and hold it drag it towards this end as you watch this white um a uh, um design to match the black one here so as it matches you release it it's going to generate a qr code as it generates the qr code you need to screenshot the qr code and send it to anybody your friend or anybody you knows that uses wechat to uh, scan the qr code using his or her uh, from his or her wechat in order to verify you then you come back and complete your sign up okay so watch as i do that you're going to click on this blue i'll uh, watch it move it to match uh, this other one as it matches it you release it okay you can see so it's going to um reload and uh, get you the scan code okay so this is the uh qr the qr code this is the qr code so what you need to do is to screenshot this qr code like i'm going to do right now you screenshot it okay save it to your phone and then go back to uh, your whatsapp and send it to anybody who is to verify you okay like i'm going to show you i'm going to shut down this video i mean open up my account my other account and try to immediately verify this account okay so i'm going to continue the video from so now i have logged in into my um old wechat account so for verification when you send it to your friend what your friend need to do or the person who is to verify you is to open up the wechat and locate the plus icon at the top here okay just locate it click on it the person will click on it in order to verify you so as you click on it it's going to see the scan code yeah you can see the scan option here so you need to click on the scan okay as it clicks on the scan it's going to uh, take you or take the person to this page so the next thing the person need to do is to um, locate the image icon at the right you can see the image icon at the right here you need to locate it then click on it so as he clicks on it it's going to refresh and load all the images okay you can see here you have the the, the uh, qr code we just scanned okay which is this first one here okay so that's what the person will be 
uh, scanning. So if the person still have um, uh, opportunity to scan codes, it's going to tap on that particular scan code and WeChat is going to load and scan the code like it is processing it now. So it's still on process. That's what is processing. So this is what happens on the end or on the side of the person who is to verify or to scan your QR, your Q, uh, WeChat QR code in order to verify you. So as we're watching it, it's going to process and uh, give uh, us reason. You can see it says uh, help friend register. I said confirm that you your friend is registering from WeChat. So the next thing is just to click on OK. OK, click on OK. It has scanned the code. The person will click on OK. If it's a, uh, uh, the you can see assistant registration successful. So the next thing you need to do is to click on close. That's for the person who is verifying you. Is going to click on close. You can see now it has it have uh, closed it. So the next thing you need to do is to the person that is signing up the account. This person that just scanned your code will go back and tell you on whatsapp and chat you up telling you that um he has successfully completed the sign of the the scanning of code okay so the next thing you need to do is to log in into your new wechat account and then complete the process which i'm going to show you now so i'm going to pause this video here and continue from uh, the new account i'll sign up into the new account and continue the process so that you see what happens next okay let's go okay so right now i've logged out of my um old account which i i just scanned the code of uh, the new account the old account which i used to scan the code of the uh, new wechat sign up uh, qr code okay so i need to um, log in or start the process of the new wechat account so i'll click here i'll click on sign up okay I'm going to open up this page like usual um the username um uh, country phone number okay and then password now i'm going to pause this video and enter all these details and then we'll continue from there so now everything is done now i want to emphasize a little bit on the phone number if you're entering the phone number um the nigeria you choose has taken care of the first zero okay you have plus two three four it has taken care of the first zero so if you are entering your phone number skip the first zero that begins with zero seven zero or zero eight zero so you're going to start from seven zero down or eight zero down you don't need to include the first zero that begins with it okay so the next thing you need to do is to click on sign up So as if you are starting up the um, sign up again, okay. So it's going to load into the privacy policy. You um, uh, need to accept the privacy privacy policy like we did the first time, okay. You need to click here, accept it, and then click on next. We we'll click on next, okay. So now it's going to load into the security verification. We we'll allow it to load then. So it's still processing okay so it will now check and you can see the security verification so we'll click on start then click on start you So you check the puzzle then it's going to load and take you to this page okay you're waiting for sms you can see here we're waiting for sms you can see the sms 028915 028915 028915 028915 okay you click on next
you can see the WeChat account is successfully created. Now the WeChat account is successfully created. So as you receive the um, the code, as you receive the code, it's going to land you. It's going to process and land you to this uh, page. You can see unable to load contacts. Now you have successfully created a new WeChat account. Okay. So this is the processes of creating a WeChat account. Now I'm going to um, go through uh, certain features on WeChat immediately so that you will find it easy as you, after signing up, you can navigate the uh, application and use it um, effectively to chat your Chinese suppliers. First off, um, we have where you have this, anyone you see that turns green like this means you are on that particular menu. Okay, like you look at uh, here, you have number one, these are menus, you have number two, you have number three and number four. Okay, all these has uh, their different features. Now, the first one is for chats. It's going to show chats, list of people you have chatted with. Okay, it's going to list it here. Then the second one is people in your contacts. Okay, it's people you have saved uh, their contact, their WeChat contacts. It's going to also show um, uh, um, people that are in your saved uh, phone contacts. Okay, so uh, this other one, we don't really uh, use it. But here, you can use it to discover a lot of things. Either people uh, who are on WeChat, you, if you click on it, let's just click on it. Okay, you can see on the contacts you see you have uh, new friends you have group chats you have tags okay then the second the third one is um oh sorry go back a uh, third one is uh discover you click on it it's going to show you you'll be seeing moments you have the scan option also you have shake this shake is actually you can use it to find friends that are near you if your no location is turned on okay uh top stories for people who updated their moments you can also use this option to search this is also for people that are nearby if you click on it it's going to show you people that are nearby but for the shake option you can use it when you shake it is going to load refresh and show you options of people you can um ask for friend request okay so the next one is um uh, me this is where you find other options that relates to your account okay you can use it to manage your account you can see the settings here okay you can see uh sticker gallery you can see my post a post you have in your uh, moments you can see favorite options you have uh, things you have favorited okay so we'll go back um if you want to add someone to wechat maybe you copy the supplier's um contact from wechat what you need to do is to click on chats okay you see okay so here you need to if you copy the contacts you need to click where you have uh, the search icon here okay you click on it click on it it's going to okay it's still processing but that's what you need to do because this is a new account that's what you need to do as you click on it it's going to show you um a search option then under the search up inside the search option you have to paste the phone number or the wechat contact you rightly copied and then you can add now in my subsequent subsequent videos i'm going to be showing you how to do that easily okay so this is how you create wechat account if you found value from this video please click on the make sure you cl click on the um, like button and also share this video don't forget to subscribe and turn on the notification bell if you're just coming across my channel for the first time thank you for watching come back for more videos bye